Hi, music students. Today, I thought I would teach you about the difference between a major and a minor. Sound, key, chord, you've probably heard all of these terms, but listen with your ears and you'll be able to tell the difference, even if you're not sure what these terms mean. And I'll explain them as we go. So normally we hear lots of music with kind of a bright, happy sound and the tune or the chords or the notes that are made to build up that song come from the major scale. So I'm playing in C major. Listen to some of the main chords of C major. are all major chords. C, G, and F. Now those are just the main major chords in the key of C, but we're using a major key which gives it a bright, fun, happy sound. A lot of people say it sounds sweeter or happier to them. A lot of times I think that's because the music that people make with this kind of sound has a happy theme to it. We might have happy lyrics, we might have a more fun, upbeat tempo. I make you wanna dance, right? So what if I changed it to a minor key? Listen to this, I'm gonna try C minor so it's the exact same uh, first chord except now it's a minor chord. in C minor, it would be very different. And the F chord would be back to C minor. So what did I change to go from major to minor? Well, there's lots of different scales that I can explain on a different day, but mainly the main thing you wanna know is that when I'm playing a chord, three main notes. We call this a triad because that means three. One, two, three. And for a major chord like C major, we have C, E, and G. To make it into a minor chord, I'm only going to need to change one note. I'm starting with these three. I just need to make the middle note a flat note. So instead of E, I'm going to reach over and play the black key. Now I have a C minor chord. Can you hear the difference? Listen to major. Listen to minor. I bet you heard the difference. Let's try on a G chord. Here's major. Close your eyes. We're going to do a mini ear training quiz. Can you tell the difference on the next three chords, which one is major and which one is minor? I want you to jot it down or just remember which one you think you hear. So I'm going to put, excuse me, I'm going to play a chord. You tell me what you hear. Is this chord major or minor? One more time. What do you think? I'll tell you the answer in a second. Here's to chord number two, major or minor. Mm, listen to it again. Okay, chord number three is gonna be this one. time. Mm, 
major or minor? I'll give you the answers. All right, so the first chord I played was actually, um, I, I don't remember, I think it was F. Actually, I know it was a major chord. So the first one was major. The second chord I played was minor. And then the last one, gosh, I couldn't decide, but I love minor, so I played minor one more time. And if you guessed it differently, your ears are just still learning the difference between what major and minor sound like. So you might wanna watch the video again and practice some more. We'll work some more on ear training and learning the difference for what to listen for in major and minor on another class. Have a great week and I'll see you soon, bye.